For city dwellers that are looking to connect with their greener roots, things can be challenging because everything fresh comes from outside their urban spaces. Manila Grow Kits bridges that gap by letting people grow their own plants and bringing fresh products straight into the heart of the city. It started out uh, because I have, there's something missing in my life. I've been working for our family business for almost six years. The family business is basically selling organic fertilizers. So mostly I'm on the rural areas. I was really trying to think of products or services that I can offer here in Metro Manila since I'm a self-confessed urban dweller. And then I really thought of putting out an organic grow kit. The initial idea was to box up products or services that are within my reach. So for three months, I developed a product and really served me the purpose of really trying to have an outlet for my creativity. Since it's a grow kit, you must have to try it. And then after sewing it for four, four days, I think uh, it sprouted. And I think that is the turning point for Manila Grow Kits. It, I can still remember the exact date. It's March 23, 2016 when it sprouted. And I always go back to this particular moment because for me, Having to work in an agriculture company for almost five to six years, I haven't grown anything in my life. And seeing a basil sprout right in front of your very eyes, it's very magical for me. Since then on, the entire motivation of Manila Grow Kits is really try to replicate that magical feeling I had as a first-time grower and really try to offer it to first-time growers as well. For Carlo and his team, they had a specific target in mind, their fellow millennials. What we have is a box that actually talks to them, that actually communicates to them that what you want in the future, you can do it right now. You can grow your own food, you can be responsible to a certain thing, you can actually commit, you can actually have patience. When we sell in bazaars, people question, I don't have a green thumb. That's the number one challenge. So how do we answer this? Personally, me, I really didn't have a green thumb. Back when I was in second grade, I didn't get to grow my own mongo. But Manila Grow Kits gave me hope that I'm actually growing now my own tomato. We want to share the same experience of actually growing your own food to all the urban dwellers, that they have hope in uh, growing plants. With this goal in mind, the team set out to develop a product that integrated farming into today's busy lifestyles. First consideration in thinking of the components to put in the plant kits is of course, it has to be complete. Everything that a first-time grower needs in order for him to successfully grow a plant must be included in the kit. As it shows, millennials usually have a very short attention span. So we really try to address that by offering products or plants that sprout within five or seven days. So we really have to address these core values of the millennials and we really have to make sure that all the seeds, all the components, all the organic fertilizers being used in the grow kits are or will actually work for them. Another thing is convenience for the millennials. Realizing this, um, our marketing for millennial grow kits is really trying to open up all the avenues for them. They can purchase our grow kits uh, via our website. We have retail partners across Metro Manila. That really makes it easy for them and fast for them to really start planting, I guess. So by providing people a very quick and easy means for them to really grow their food. I think we're really helping people embrace this lifestyle. The team also uses creative means of reaching out to their generation. So Manila Grow Kits is a tool for millennials and urban dwellers to actually engage in agriculture. So how do we approach our target market who are really tech savvy? We do a lot of social media. We execute them in a way that people will be attracted to it and it's very social media friendly. It's Instagrammable. And we're here to give you an idea on how you can start growing your plants using Manila Grow Kids products. We start off with our best seller, our plant kit. You have everything you need to plant. You have your pot, you have your soil, your fertilizer, instruction manual. You just add water. The smaller version of our plant kit is our seed blanket, only 89 pesos. So Grow It's, it's a sprouting system that has all the resources you need to start sprouting your favorite seeds. So all you have to do is rinse it with water twice a day and you're sure to enjoy uh, your favorite sprouts within seven days. We also have our plant food. So it's 100% organic fertilizer made of 100% chicken manure needed to nourish your plants. Also, if you are very much into farming and you have a bigger, say, space, we also have the Bird and Dung line, which basically offers different products, particularly uh, soil and potting mixes for you to use to your garden beds. And last but not the least, we have our garden kit. It comes in flower garden, salsa kit, 
pizza kit, salad kit, herb kit, and it's composed of four plant kits, all in one garden kit. In order to share the joys of growing your own plants, these kits are also available as giveaways at weddings, kids' parties, and other events. To celebrate local talent and to bring color into urban gardens, they also have collaborations with Filipino artists. Aside from millennials, moms also buy products from us. Why? Because it's a very good tool that gives their children experience of having a good practice of patience, the practice of being responsible to a certain thing. The main reason why we wake up every day really feeling happy that we're doing this because we're hearing a lot of stories that it's their first time to grow and they're a couple of days away from harvesting their first tomato. And it really gives us this sense of accomplishment that we're really close to what we envision for our product and for the whole company. The gift of our product is actually the gift that grows, not only literally, but also metaphorically. So basically, we impart the values of good practice and patience, not only to millennials, but also to kids that will be the future generation. So inspire people, and also the kids, the future of our country and the future of the world, to grow their own food. By providing those living in the Metro Manila the opportunity or parang an easy way for them to appreciate farming and growing in general, I think we're really trying to give them a preview of how, on how easy rather, it is to really embrace the sustainable kind of living. The dream is, is, of course, to rally people back into agriculture. What we wanted is to at least a people to have a connection with agriculture because we strongly believe that when you connect to something, you start to speak for it, you start to care for it, and eventually you'll start to fight for it.